Söylenen sert sepinan insan çok mu? He was wearing shorts. And in mind this was winter time. And not short shorts, but uh, you know, to be her. Capri pants, he called them. He asked me, do you know why they are called Capri pants? I don't know why. I don't know, uh, perhaps it has something to do with the Isle of Capri? No, 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 he says. Capri is short for capricious. <laughs> Even when he is not here, he is still making me laugh. He would come by most days after school. I would make him read to me David Copperfield about Charles Dickens. Or sometimes I would read to him. And he would act out the stories with hand puppets, homemade ones that he made himself at home, with real human hair. <laughs> I told you, he was not so usual a boy. That a boy like this would, would, would be in this world. In my shop, this was a miracle to me. But when I was younger, such a place did not exist. Well, not allowed to exist. Oh, boys, what I really think they're saying is boys ought to be boys. I'm not saying it's right. the salon. I'm there with my head in the sink. Leonard's giving me a shampoo and he leans down like real close and he goes, this is Dr. I know the beauty's in the eye of the beholder, but would it kill you to give him something to behold? <laughs> and then he holds up my new hair color, raspberry creme by Claro. It's like a new person person I'd always hoped to be. Huh? Well, just to say it better. To remember that. Oh, yes, of course, evidence. Ah, normally I am not so uh, nostalgic a man, sentimental, you know. Uh, look around. I live in time. I know which way it goes. <laughs> but I tell you, if I could, just this once, I would turn back the hands of every clock in this show, just to be able to say to Leonard, don't go. Sit with me a while longer. Stay. And say that Leonard Pelkey was a good person. He changed my life. He changed the lives of everyone in this town.